Now what I really want to know is... Can I slide down it? Gotta try it. Uh, slowly slide down. <laughs>Welcome back to Power Wash Simulator. We are picking right up where we left off, and I've been doing a little background work on this playground because this was a huge job. If you remember last episode, this whole floor was just trashed. So I've got the floor done because I thought that would be the take the longest, and to be honest, probably the the most boring part of this job. So this is a big job. These $500 jobs take some time. I've spent, just FYI, if you're playing this game, I've probably spent 30 minutes just on this floor. So it does take some, take some time. So what I want to do today, we, we're going to head to the shop, and I'm going to, I want to buy some tools and see if, see how they, if they help us, you know, how they work. So... We have the. Let me make sure we got the Prima Vista 1500, which is the starter power washer. So the equipment we can buy, we can buy a short extension, we can buy a long extension. Our soap. Uh, let's see, this is the turbo nozzle. I'm gonna wait on that one. Oh, this is for the 3000. We have the 1500. So I think the only things we can buy are the short extension let's buy that it's only $25 and the long extension so the info on this says improves the range while still being able to be used quite close to surfaces and the long range improves the range of the washer but cannot be used when close to a surface all right so let's going to we're going to try those and see we're at 44% on this job. So let's see how we equip them. Equip is E. There we go. Current loadout. Okay. Click on click on the extension. And we can go long or short. So let's start with the start with the long one. See what that does for us. Let's see. Let's go with the yeah. Let's go with the green. Obviously, it gives us a better reach. Which should come in handy on items like this, or places like this. I'm hitting R to rotate the nozzle. And if you right mouse click, you just have you don't have to hold down the button. It just continually the water, which is great. We hold tab to check to see where the dirt's at. And you can hold tab or hit tab even as you're spraying. Continue to kill this tall stuff. So that's reaching pretty good without a ladder. Nice. Yeah, 
Yeah, I'm able to get that gable up there, it looks like. Without climbing up there. Well, not all of it. I may have to still use a ladder to get up there. Now, let's see if I can hit this roof. Yeah, I think you're still gonna have to get a ladder up there. That's what I wanted to test, actually, was to see if you could hit hit the roof stuff without a ladder. I don't think you, I don't think it'll reach it. Yeah, I'm not gonna reach it. This one maybe. Standing on oh, I'm standing on the slide. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> All right. Well, but we slide down it. Okay. So, point is, it won't reach. Still have to get a ladder. All right. So let's check out the short extension. Proves the range while still being able to be used quite close to surface. If you look at the top left there, it's constantly showing the different surfaces that we're cleaning. Like here's the climbing pole, this is the wood, the wood tower. So you can really get specific if you're really trying to narrow down what it needs to be cleaned. This game, if you're like me and you're very OCD, this game can be a little frustrating uh, trying to get into every nook and cranny. And trying to get, if you're a completionist as well, trying to get 100% on everything clean. That's what I run into. But some of these, on these big jobs especially, I'm okay with uh, just getting it done. But it is rewarding. I will say that this game is rewarding. It is satisfying. I am enjoying it. They're still updating it. It's still in early access. They're still coming out with updates. Have not had one recently, but I see them making posts. In fact, the last post, they were doing a poll of sorts to see what people wanted in the game next. The job, a job, uh, what kind of jobs that they wanted. They had a couple jobs listed and that they wanted everybody to pick what they thought would be a neat job to do. I personally like the shorter jobs better. They don't take as much time, and I would, I think I would rather have several smaller jobs with less money, uh, because I feel like I get more accomplished than doing these really huge jobs. Let's, let's go prone and get underneath here. So really my goal... I guess the main goal for everyone in this game is make enough money to buy the bigger and better power washers. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm not really buying soap. The last episode, we kind of did a test run on soap. What do I got left on this monkey bar? Oh, probably the top. And the, oh, this is part of the monkey bars as well. 
Yeah, we did a sort of a test to see if the soap really mattered. In my opinion, it doesn't. And it doesn't last very long. So I think they need to do a rework on the soap. For what it cost, I think it cost 15. Let's take a look. The soap is. We have a multi purpose cleaner, wood cleaner, plastic cleaner, metal cleaner, glass cleaner. So the multi purpose is what I used. And for $10 a bottle, let's buy one. For $10 a bottle, I didn't find that it really made that much difference. We'll get on a, we'll start on a new, a new surface here. And we'll do a test, another test. Alright, so it's got to be on top then that we're missing. Alright, so we're going to have to get our ladder. There we go. Oh yeah, got all this dirty up here. All right, what am I missing here? So this is what I was talking about. I could get a little maddening when you get down to the nitty gritty. You're almost done. You're like, what am I missing? All these little cracks here. There we go. When it dings like that, that means we're done. Alright. Okay, I'm just going to try the soap show you guys again the soap and you can form your own opinion on it. Let's go over here. Let's go over here to the old dinosaur. Because he is pretty dirty. So we hold uh, three. And we've got stone cleaner and multi-purpose cleaner. There we go. So I'm not sure if, see it's just kind of spotty there. So are we, are we supposed to just put the soap on there first and then hose it down? Is that the plan? So we got we got this side done fairly quickly using the soap. With the exception of these areas down here, we didn't spray the soap on. Okay, so if we go to the other side. completely covered. And if we just just spray them down without the soap.
and we do it just as fast without the soap. My point. I think we can. Well, I just I don't think the, the soap does enough. Maybe I'm using it wrong. See, when you hit tab, I mean, it's still pretty dirty. So again, maybe I'm using it wrong. Let's go to a little wider nozzle here. See if we can get this done a little faster. Well, it just doesn't get down the cracks though when you go wider. Sometimes rotating helps. This poor dinosaur has been neglected for a long time. The Stego Slide. Well, it shows we're over halfway done, so I'm hoping that we can... I think this will be one of those where... We can get away with not getting every nook and cranny. Now what I really want to know is, can I slide down it? Gotta try it. Uh, slowly slide down. <laughs> Maybe it slides better when it's clean. This side should get us really close. All right, so it's probably just underneath now. We gotta do that prone power washing. All right, we're close. Here's where we really need to take take our extensions off. get closer. Oh, I missed a whole leg over here. That's the problem. Alright. Mr. Dino is being stubborn. There we go, finally. Wow. That one took a while. Sure is pretty though. Now, let's see if we can slide down it better. No, it's still a slow slide. Okay. Sure is pretty though. Alright, let's throw a little soap on this one as well. Add a multi-purpose cleaner. See how fast it goes? It really goes fast. have to go yellow on this one. This grime is not coming off. All 
Alright, we finally got the slide done. Alright, so we're only at 59% guys on this job, so I'm gonna go ahead and finish it up and then I'll get back with you. So we got a new job po pop open. Let's take a look at it. If it'll let us look at it. Yeah, so we got two new jobs. We got clean the detached house, clean the golf cart. I think, yeah, we already had to clean the bungalow. So clean the d detached house, $650 job. So that's probably gonna be a huge job. So what I wanna know is we're only we're only at 60% on this job, so I'm probably probably just going to finish this off camera because it's going to take some time. So what I want to know is, can we can we do a new job and come back to this job? Let's find out. Mayor Jeff Jefferson, I need to claim my sorry golf cart. You might have heard about my poor cat, Ulysses, going missing. We're all frantic with worry, what with the ceremony just around the corner. I swear I saw him on the golf course, frolicking on the lily pads in the lake by the 13th, part 3, but I, was always, but I always get a birdie. By the time I realized it was just a boisterous carp, it was too late. I slammed on the brakes and went tumbling down the slope head over tail. Don't worry, docs have given me the all-clear, said they'd never seen anyone recover from such a minor incident in so little time. But the cart needs a hose down. Okay, so let's see if we can start this job. We can. So we can do, do the smaller jobs and then come back to our bigger jobs, which is cool. That's what I was hoping for. This job only pays $100. But it's going to be a whole lot faster. Golf Man! Okay, never heard of that brand. I don't actually think it is a brand. So now I'm just going no, yeah, no extensions. Tell you what, one thing we haven't looked at is the different nozzles. What do we need for the next power washer? We need $900. Okay, let's, um, get this turbo nozzle. Uh, I tried this in the last episode. I'm not crazy about it. Let's go ahead and buy it. It's only $15. And I don't think I'm crazy about it. Oh yeah, it spins around. Well, I got that hubcap clip pretty clean. I'm sure there'll be certain applications It's pretty powerful. It seems to do well on wheels. Just use a circular motion. Yeah, it does well on wheels. But as far as the rest of the body of a vehicle, I don't know that I'm crazy about it. Yeah. I like my yellow. Red for the details, yellow for just a standard. So that's nice. I, I'm glad that they did that in the game. Created it so you could, you know, if you get tired of a job and you get a new one pop up, you can go to it and then come back to the other job. I was really hoping that was the case, and it is. 
So that's awesome. Good job, developers. Stuff like this, again, it's only a hundred bucks, but it goes super, super quick. Get down and get underneath. And it won't be long, and it'll pop up a list of what we have left. I know we still have to get through. Chassis. Body. Alright, where's our ladder at? Our stool, I mean. It pops up to do list canopy, rear canopy support, and a windshield. So that's really cool. So it checks it off when you get it done. We got the inside of the windshield to do here. There we go. And the rear canopy support. I think that was this right here. There we go. Cool. Job complete. Looking at the golf cart looking at the golf cart now, it's almost like the whole thing never happened. You're a genius. Dirt finder, much obliged. <laughs> Dirt finder, nice. Alright, so we hit escape. Shows a nice recap of our cleaning job. Really cool. Hit continue. We earned a hundred dollars for that. And they gave us a five star rating, it looks like. Alright, so we still have two new jobs. The bungalow, attached house. These are our completed jobs that we've done. And in progress is the clean the playground. So I will finish that again off camera. I will probably stop before I'm just done. But we still got 40% to go on this and it's, it's a long job. So we'll finish that next episode. I'll show you what that looks like when it's done and we'll and we'll hit some of these other jobs. So if you like this episode today, guys, make sure to hit that thumbs up button. I do appreciate it. And if you're new to the channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button. I appreciate each and every one of you that subscribes. Helps me out a lot. So come back and join me for more episodes of Power Wash Simulator. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.